Yeah, that's right. I am taping you up right now as we speak. <laughs> I am taping my phone to the door so I could do this. <clears throat> Alright, welcome to the show. If you don't know already, my name is Iggy, MV5679, and this is Get Truth or Die Line, because it's truth to die, baby. That's the new slogan. We're about to trademark it, throw it on the t-shirts, and as you can see this t-shirt here, right? See that, right? Everybody see that? Everybody see that? Yeah, I'm, I'm from Pittsburgh, if you, if you don't know already. I'm going to tell you, all right? So, first off, guys, I'm a little... I mean, I know people have been waiting for this. I know I know you've been waiting for this, so, you know, this time I'm going to give people what, what they want. Usually, I don't give the people what they want. I give the people what they need. This time, I'm going to give y'all what y'all want and what you need. So, as you know, my name is Iggy, all right? I'm from Pittsburgh. I'm in the truther community, you know. I mean, I guess to some I'm not, but anyway, so... I'm a, I'm a little heated about something though, and honestly, yeah, I know I know this is titled about John. You know what I'm saying? So we going we're gonna jump in that, but I'm not even heated about that. That that is just that's that's like funny to me. That's like entertainment to me what he does. But I I I, I want to get it. Forget John right now. We're starting off with something else. All right. So listen, guys, we've been in the last stream the last couple of nights. Trolls come in, trolls leave, trolls come in and play cool, sometimes trolls come in and play troll. However, no matter what, guys, I want you to remember something, I want you to understand something, I'm very, very serious about this. We are a truther community. We're community, okay? Which means, I don't want people in there arguing with each other, alright? There's no reason for anybody to be in there. That is actually a subscriber, okay? That's on my side. That's on that should be in there disliking each other, okay? Now we already call each other families, okay? We're we're building friendships. We're we're coming together. We're getting closer every day, guys. All right. The last thing we need to be doing is turning on each other. All right. Listen to me seriously. It 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 bothers me to see this because you know like. All the back biting, biting people's backs out, you know, turning their back on people and the backstabbing, talking behind each other's back. That's uncalled for. Families argue. There's no doubt about that. But at the end of every day, families come together, okay? And that's what I want to see us do at the end of every day is come together, okay? Like I said, we're getting closer. Also, take this in as a, a way to look at this point of view. Us being, you know, supposedly on the same side, every time we turn and argue with each other, we look weak to the enemy, all right? Not only that, we look weak to John and Marf. We don't want, we don't want to look weak to them, okay? We don't, we don't want to give them any satisfaction. We are family and we stick together, bottom line, and no one comes between us. Nothing comes between us. Do not break your loyalty, okay? That is my number one thing is loyalty, okay? I give you mine, you give me yours. The trust is there. Don't cross it once, and we ain't never got nothing to worry about, all right? So we're not telling you, man, let the trolls come in. Let them come in. Let them do their thing, all right? Never, ever let a troll get you to argue with each other, okay? If you see a troll come in, and then you tell someone, like, yo, that's a troll, and that person's being nice to the troll, but the person that's being nice to troll, you are both my subscribers, right? We're, we're a family. But you see one of your family members, one of your friends being nice to a troll. And you're like, yo, you keep telling her or him, yo, that's a troll, that's a troll, that's a troll. And they're just being nice. Don't get mad at them. Remember, that's, the, that's what the troll wants. That's what the troll's doing. The troll is trolling you by getting you mad because you, he's talking to one of your family members. And he knows that you don't like him. Think about it, alright? Come on, guys. I've been through enough pain, heartache, drama, violence in my life. Like, I've been in conflicts my entire life. Confrontations. I've been in the eye of the storm my entire life. I'm still in it. 
I battle demons every day. I come face to face with them. And that's what I do. I face them. And I put my hands up and I fight them. And I fight. I fight. I'm a fighter. I'm never going back down. But you know what? I fight them every day. And, and, and lately, you know, knock on wood, but I've been achieving. It's one day at a time. One step at a time. One bit of information at a time to research. All right? That's how I'm living now. And I need you guys on my side. I need your guys' support. All right? But I don't want you guys arguing with each other. And I don't want you coming to me with petty-ass drama and high school shit. Okay? We're adults. Okay? And at the bottom line is, if we don't stick together, we ain't shit. This is nothing. Okay? All this means nothing if we don't stick together. If you got if you if you got a disagreement with someone, talk to them. Listen, when you talk to people, I'm telling you, you would never ever see how you know you think you don't like someone, and you talk to them, you're like, wow. I mean, you just gotta open up sometimes, talk to people, and you get to know someone. And you're like, damn, this person's cool. All right. I just wanna I just wanna start it off with that. All right, now, now, John X. All right. So, as you guys may know. I'm talking to every John X subscriber. If you unsubscribe, subscribe. If you just seen it, dude, right? So some of you guys might have seen a uh, video put up yesterday, right? Uh, I don't know what it was called. What was it called? Guys, you remember what it was called? I don't know what it was called. Anyway, he keeps talking about the Pittsburgh synagogue shooting, right? How and he keep, you see how he keeps throwing out there. There's no truthers in Pittsburgh, so he didn't even know about it and. He has to cover Pittsburgh and this, that, and the third, right? Okay, so just so you know, he's talking about me, okay? See the hat, see the pee, okay? Um, when I edit this video before I upload it, I will throw in there so you guys know John knows who I am. I'm going to throw in there a, snap, a screenshot that I have of him subscribing to my channel. So you know he's a, he's actually one of my subscribers, okay? I'll show you the screenshot. So you know he's talking about me, okay? You can look at my videos. I'm in the city every day. I'm from Pittsburgh. He's talking about me. For all you subscribers of John that might never came across me, yeah, that video where he was saying about the truth from Pittsburgh, there ain't none. Yeah, he's talking about me, right? Right, me. That's what he's talking about. But you see, he won't say my name, Iggy MB five six seven nine, or even Iggy, because he's scared to give me exposure to you guys. He's scared to say my name because he knows if he says my name, you might go look me up. And then you might see all these videos I got. See the laptop right there? You might see all the videos I got uploaded exposing the shit out of him, okay? Now John, you're making me do this to you, remember that. You're making, you keep starting with me. You're making me do this to you, okay? You won't keep trolling me, ah, uh, well. Let me tell you something, Johnny. You wanna talk about being a man, cuz? A man, though, you won't even say my name. You won't even come at me directly. And you want to talk about being a man? And you won't even come at me directly? Because you're scared of your subscribers seeing me? Bro, if I'm wrong and if I'm a liar, why are you so scared of your subscribers seeing what I said about you then, huh? Why are you so scared of being exposed by me? If I'm a liar. Now, mind you guys, I don't even got 300 subscribers, okay? This dude got 215,000. He's making videos trolling me. He comes in every live stream with multiple different names trolling my live streams. All right. Not only that, okay. What was I about to say? Damn, what was I about to say? He trolls me. He makes videos about me. Oh, not only that. <laughs> so, he brought the Pittsburgh Synagogue shoot. All right, guys? He brought that up, okay? Now, <laughs> not only is that old news, what he said today, okay, but me, the truther of Pittsburgh, you hear me, John? I'm the truther of Pittsburgh. This is my city, baby. This is my city. You could never, ever turn my city on me. Fool, you crazy? You could never turn this city on me. If you come down here and you ask somebody and they don't know me, they don't know me. If you ask somebody and they do know me, they're going to tell you. Lil Iggy's a thoroughbred. He's official. He's on that bullshit. But he's a good dude with a good ass heart. That's what they're going to tell you. They'll tell you, don't try him. Don't try him, Johnny. They're going to tell you that. 
But I'm just like, you know, you can never turn my city on me, bro. That was, you, you made yourself look dumb right there. That's why you deleted it, man. And everybody in Pittsburgh, if you watch this dude, you know, he just came at you too. But I'm not worried about it. I got Pittsburgh. That's, that's easy, man. That's easy. I know I got Pittsburgh. The East Coast is mine, Morph. The East Coast is mine, y'all. So it's mine. And I'm coming from, I'm coming to the Midwest and I'm coming West Coast. All right, you just want to play this game with me, so I'm going to go hard now. I'm going to go hard on both of you. The East Coast is mine. I'm coming to the Midwest next, and then I'm taking the West Coast. And I'm fucking with Baffled by Bullshit, Mike D, and so. Oh, yeah, so good luck on sending me that video, because I didn't catch it, John. I'll be watching you no more. But my man, so, sent me that video. So good luck, so. Sovereign Humanoid 33. Everybody go check him out if you don't know him. Sovereign Humanoid 33. He exposes John. If you don't know, Baffled by Bullshit. He exposes John and Marfugal News. He does a great job. I mean, he exposes the shit out of them. And Mike Dolishny also exposes the shit out of dudes. Both of them. And he does a good job, too. Me, I've been trying to fall back. I've been trying to focus on other shit. I've been trying to do my thing, right? And it's been taking up. It's time consuming. Like, it's been taking up my life for real. I'm, on, I'm running on four. I'm running on fumes right now. I'm running on four hours of sleep in the last motherfucking two days. But you know what? I'm here. I'm doing this. Let's go. Let's get it. All right? Because this is what's about. It's about waking people up. So that's why I'm staying woke. I'm not sleeping. All right? So anyway, so good look, guys. Go check them out. They're cool dudes, you know? But me, I've been trying to fall back. And dude wants to come at me now. Well, you fucked up. So you made me do this. So now, listen, right? He won't talk about we ain't got no truthers in Pittsburgh. He keeps saying it right in the video. You just know. You just know how corners do this. Yeah, we ain't got no truthers in Pittsburgh. We ain't got no... Bro... You all know, I covered this story a month ago on my main channel, which John called YouTube and got deleted because I was exposing him on. So, the reason you guys can't see on this channel that I uh, covered the synagogue shooting, I did gematria to it, and the, and the gun, as far as the gun stocks and the gun laws, that's old news, bro. Like, here, let me go get the laptop and show you. Hold on. Okay, as you guys can see, zoom in. Pittsburgh considers stricter gun laws after synagogue attack, okay? 11 people got killed, supposedly. I think it was a fake shooting, honestly, staged. But anyway, let me show you the date on this, guys. Mind you, John showed this yesterday. And the date is December 14th, 2018. And John just showed this, and he's dogging me for not talking about it. Yet... I talked about this a month ago. Here you go, right here. My fault, not 14th, 18th. December 18th, 2018. Zoom in on that, check it out. 9.40 a.m. All right, now this talks about the gun laws. Pittsburgh City Council began considering a package of gun control laws on Tuesday, including a ban on assault-style rifles nearly two months after a gunman shouting anti-Semitic message killed 11 people in a synagogue. synagogue. He said all Jews must die, and he starts shooting with an assault rifle, okay? Now, mind you, I've gotten pissed for my whole life. There's been assault rifles on the street my entire life, okay? There's been multiple homicides with assault rifles. People die here every day. Guns are everywhere. That's what's what, what people do nowadays, okay? A lot of them are illegal. Some of them are illegal, okay? Well, with that said, it's talking about them banning Who's he talking about them banning stocks and banning the, uh, yeah, he's talking about them banning gun stocks, I think. This is the same article he had, he had up. I just have to go through it, which I really got a lot of talk about, so I don't want to do all that. Because this is old news, guys, I covered it. The Gematria is right on point with this, um... Actually, it might be on this channel, the Gematria I did to this, actually. You know what? I'm going to check it out. If it is, I'm going to put the link in the description. I might have the Gematria of the synagogue shooting on this channel. Um, anyway, guys, the, the fact of the matter is, this is a month old. He just showed it yesterday. Okay. Now, once again... Once again, you'll never turn the city on me, Johnny boy. All right. Now, with that said, man, I sometimes I sit here and I think, right? You know, I, I, I'm a Christian. I'm a believer. Hallelujah. Then the Holy Spirit. Hope I'm saved. I've done a lot of bad things in my life. Okay. 
Um, by the way, one more tip. I'm going to make a video tomorrow, and I'm going to completely tell you in a brief video some of my life story and why I went to prison. So we're going to get that out there. And then I'm going to put that as the little thing at the beginning of my channel, the video that anyone could watch that tells you about the channel. I'm going to do that, and I'm going to tell everyone why I went to prison, all right? So we just get that out and get that bullshit. I went to prison for some bullshit. The thing is, is, I got a very bad record and a very long record, and I'm a repeat felon, which in Pennsylvania is considered a refell. Okay, I have possession with intent delivers piled up since juvenile, all felony ones. Okay, we in Pennsylvania we got a felony one, a felony two, and a felony three. Okay, that that's that's that stimulates the guidelines of your sentence. Anyway, back to Johnny. So sometimes I sit there and I think, like you know, like listen, guys, you cannot knock the man for getting money. It's not about him getting money, you know? Like, all, all, anyone, man, don't ever let that bother you, the man making money. Like, who cares? Don't let that bother you, because if you let that eat up at you, then then that, you know what I mean? Let that shit go, because he's going to make it no matter what. He got enough subs, he gets the views, he's going to make the money, so forget it. Don't let that bother you. It's not about the money. It's about the way he's doing it, the, the scam and the lying, the manipulation, the elders. The mentally disabled people that he's manipulating. It's about that. That's where I come in and have a problem with it, okay? Man, God bless him for making the money, all right? It ain't about that. But sometimes I sit there and think and I go, yo, like, say dude, say John reached out to me one day. I, I, I literally think about this. You know what I mean? I say, I'm supposed to be Christian. Everything's supposed to be forgivable. So say he reached out to me and says, yo, Ig, man, listen. Bro, can you stop doing what you're doing? Can you take the videos down? Can you just stop? I have a family I'm trying to feed. This is my business. Cause you please stop. And if I'd be like, I'd probably be like, yo, bro, well, stop scaring people and I'll stop. I right, say so he was like, listen, I'll, I won't scare people no more. Da -da -da. So he denies scamming, or, but he's like, I won't, I'll stop fair porn. Or whatever. Just say he called me or something. Cause my phone is, number is still in dude's voicemail from before I started making videos when the shit with the elder lady. But whatever. I ain't gonna get into all that. But anyway. Man, that, he could dig in and that shit's in there. But say email me like. And so I think about that. Like what would I do? You know what I mean? Because as a Christian I'm supposed to forgive everything. The only thing I can't forgive is a pedophile. A, uh, like a dude that. Uh, child molesters. And if you kill women and children. That's the only shit I will never be able to forgive. Sorry God. But I just can't forgive that. Alright. The pedophile shit. Like I'm not with none of that shit. Like that is not my twist. I don't like it. I, I, well, I mean, a lot of people don't, but that, that that gets me riled up, put it like that. I don't even want to think about it. So anyway, like, I think about, damn, would I forgive dude? And when he does shit like this, man, when, I'm, when, I'm, when, I'm, when I've been falling back, and then he trolled me every night, he does shit like this. I mean, talking about Pittsburgh, talking about my city, you know what I mean? We, th this city, like, you, you don't even know, cuz. You don't even know what it's like growing up here. Like, go ahead, man. Like, go ahead. Like, don't be throwing my city in your mouth. Throwing, trying to throw dirt on it. There ain't no truth. I, I mean, actually, you, you gave them people props. But you're trying to throw dirt on my name with my city involved because you're scared to say my name. And that's where, like, now I think, like, damn. I don't even think I would forget to. Like, how do I stop? How do I stop now if you keep, if it, I keep getting provoked like that? You get what I'm saying? How do I stop? Anyway, regardless though, he's the last thing I'm going to focus on. I'm going to keep focusing on the truth. I'm going to keep focusing on the mission. I have a vision here with this channel. And my vision is what I'm going to focus on no matter what. And ain't nobody, nothing, I don't care how many big 50,000 subs you got, how many dudes, other YouTubers you got with 300,000, how many other YouTubers gang up on me. I do not care. You cannot stop me. You either get with me or you're against me. That's the only options you have. All right? So, think again for you try some shit like that, John. Because you never turn my city on me. One. Two. You ain't stopping me, bro. And three. Now. Damn, bro. You probably could have called me and been like, dog, can you just chill and I'll stop? And I'd probably be like, well, yeah, if you stop, I'll stop. Stop me in the paper. Now, it's like, damn, that might be out of question. Because, like, come like. You know what I mean? Mmm. I don't know, man. I don't really know what else to say to that. I thought it was funny. It, it was funny, though. But I'll give you that. You're good entertainment. I mean, you got 200,000 subscribers. And 195,000 of them come there either to troll or because they don't like you or because it's entertaining. And 
Another thing, I already heard that your Patreon was the one that looked it up about Pittsburgh. So remember that too. I'm a one man army on this channel, okay? I gotta do all my research myself. You got 400 Patreons doing research with you and they send it all to you. Alright? I'm here alone doing this shit, alright? And yeah, I know I'm not the sharp, I know I'm not the best truther. I don't try, I'm not, I don't never try to claim that. I, I'm far from it. I know you, I know both Ian's is smarter than me. You and Morph. Ian's are both smarter than me. Ian's both know a lot more than me. I give that to you. I ain't never argued that. I've never tried to say anything like that. And Ian's keep coming on my channel trying to troll me. Like, you know, like trying to say like I'm dumb. I don't know nothing. Like, nah, that you, that, that's doing too much. Because I, I definitely know my shit. I know what I'm talking about. You know, sometimes it doesn't come out quick enough or I stutter or something that's just how my thought process is I got scars on my brain you know what I mean I got trauma for real like I see motherfuckers die in front of me like I got visions of nasty shit I see in my dreams like I you know I'm a little messed up in my head put it like that so you know I might be a little slower process wise but I could do it if you see what I'm saying I mean put my mind in something I'm gonna get it done regardless especially when my heart's in it so I don't know, John. <clears throat> That's about all I got my reply for you. Um, you can't turn the city on me, man. This is my city. I'm the king of this city. You hear me? I'm the truth of Pittsburgh. And anyone get in my way, it's going to be the wrong decision. Because I'm coming right through you. You know what I mean? I got through, I'm telling you, I got a vision. It's set in stone, and we're going there. And I already heard, I heard, I heard more, more food. I heard. I, I see what you're doing. I see you see me. You're starting to hate on me because I'm doing long live streams. You think I'm going to get in your way. Well, listen, bro. I'm doing me. I'm doing me regardless. You know what I mean? I told you. It's either with me or against me. Obviously, he's going to play this bullshit trolling shit. So, the, hey, do you. All right? One last thing I want to touch up on, guys, before I end this because this is it. I'm done with John. Done with Marv. Shoom. <laughs> Marv, I don't even want to get in the dude. I can't, like, these dudes are actors, man. They are they are actors. Plain and simple, they're actors. He's calling, he's saying there's no <laughs> real truthers in Pittsburgh, man. Because I don't know as much as them. I don't lie like them, okay? But when it comes down to it, I'm real. Yins aren't, okay? I'm the real one. Yins are the fake ones, okay? Now, Last thing I want to say, and this is back to people that may be subscribed to me, or people that may just be watching, or maybe it's people that are trolls of John. Listen, man, this is something I'm very, very, very serious what I'm saying, all right? I heard that someone threw John's address out there and put it on my damn thing, all right? Now, I seen an address on there a couple weeks ago. I can't remember, I can't remember the name who it was. I, I didn't pay attention to it. When I seen the address on there, I deleted it. Okay, now I see dude, someone told me he made a video talking about with, uh, who was the dude, Zan Garcia, he was telling it to. No, no, no Jacob Israel. It, it was one with Jacob Israel. And he's telling him that he his, someone put his address on there. Oh, no, 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 no. He said it wasn't his, but what if it was? Listen, guys, let me tell you something. <laughs> Do not put no one's, look, and my subscribers, you know, I love you. I'm only talking to the person that did this. Don't know who it was. So whoever did that, do not put no one's damn address on the internet. Do not put someone's personal address on my shit, especially when you know I'm getting flagged, gang flagged. That's why I think it might have been a troll and it might have been a setup on me. It might have been them doing that shit on purpose, trying to get me in trouble. That's why I deleted it because I can't remember the name. But if it's someone that's one of my people, do not do that, all right? One, forget getting me in trouble. Dude, that man got kids in his house. He got a, a wife and kids in his house. Do not put him in danger like that. You don't know what psychos are watched on the internet. Some people might, like you're really putting people's lives in danger doing that. Please, guys, don't do that, man. Please, don't do that. That's serious, man. Like, please, don't do that. I, I need you to understand something real quick. I understand I'm feuding with John X Army, and I am feuding with him, all right? We're not cool. We're not cool by any means. But listen, I don't hate him, all right? I don't want nothing bad to happen to that dude. You get what I'm saying? It's not like that, all right? This is some petty internet shit. 
okay? And it's only about doing the right thing. It's not about hurting nobody, all right? You just need to get that shit straight, please, because, I, and I know a lot of you are good-ass people. I talked to so many of my subscribers that are, I even met one last night. Good-ass dude, Dame, shout out, Dame, you know what I mean? El Cholo Loco Soroso, huh? But I met so many good, I talked to so many subscribers that are good ass people with good ass horse. All yens, man. I don't even want to, I don't want to start saying names. All yens, recovering soul, Lynn, uh, Kat, all yens, all yens. Jess, everyone, everyone. Lady B, all you guys. Wendy, all right, don't, no one start getting offended if I don't say, I can't say everyone's name. <laughs> Listen. All the I talk to, man, you you know who I am. I'm talking to Michelle, Sean, all the These are good ass people with good ass hearts and open minded individuals that can meet on a on a common ground with people that you disagree with, and that's what makes this such a, a unique community. Okay, that's what gives us our name. That's what makes us unique. All right, but the last thing I'm ever gonna do is put a man that got kids and a wife in jeopardy. All right, we're not doing that, okay? Do not hate this man, okay? If you feel like you hate him, chill. It ain't like that, all right? I don't want, I know I got animosity. I understand I come off crazy and goofy and I'm shot out. I get that, but listen, this is just me. I'm a goofball, all right? But but I'm, but, but I'm a lovable dude. I'm loving, I'm loving, I'm caring. I am, and no, I don't love dude or not. It ain't no homo shit, but I'm, look, man. Please, don't put no one's address up there. That that ain't cool, all right? What if that is his real address? That's not cool. I don't support that. I don't approve of that. Do not do that, all right? Hey, there's kids there. Think what I'm saying, all right? There's kids there. You know how some people are. Think about it. There's crazy-ass people out here, all right? So, look, I love you, man. I don't want you to do that no more. Whoever did it, it's it's all right. Just don't do it again, all right? And if it was a troll, you're aware of Because if you're, you guys are trying to set me up to get my channel, like, in trouble, like, I'm putting personal information out there, that's corny, bro. That, 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 that's, that's, like, going too far. Like, I'm, I ain't never do that. I never looked you up. I'm not doing all that weird shit like that, bro. I'm doing simple off of what you say on your videos, and I reply to them or I expose on them. Whatever, but all the looking up, I don't need to do all that. It ain't that deep. But, guys, if you have hate in your heart, let it go. It's going to hurt to live like that, all right? Let, let, let the hate go, all right? Spread the love, man. That's what this channel is about, all right? I don't want to be hateful. And if I come off like that, I apologize, guys. Please don't take me wrong. All right? It's all love with me. Everyone who subscribers, you know I got love for you, all right? I don't hate dude, though, man. I don't hate that he makes money. He's going to make that money regardless. You can't be mad at that. It's not about that. It's about how you do it, okay? So let's let that go. If you're somebody that hates him and despises him because of the money, please let it go. I'm not spiteful. This is not out of spite. I'm not doing this out of spite. I'm doing this because I believe it's the right thing. I'm doing this because I believe it needs to be done. And I'm doing this because I believe somebody needs to stand up to him. Alright? But I don't wish harm on him. And I don't hate him. Alright? So I don't want you to hate him. And I don't want you to wish harm on him. Okay? Pray for him. Pray for John X Army. Pray that he gets it in his head and he changes. Okay? Pray for his family. He got kids. Alright? That's what we're supposed to do. We're supposed to love our enemies. Okay? And I'm not, I'm nowhere near there. I don't love him or Marv. For all, I want to bash both of their heads together like that. But but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. You get what I'm saying? I mean, like, doing. Not like, not like, come on, guys. You know what I'm saying? They're going to tell me for that. They're going to tell me for that. I got to delete this video. It's like, nah, I'm not deleting it. But, yo, you know what I'm saying. I just want to mug, push them. I just want to push them back. Like, get, yo, yo, like, like, like chill out, cuz. You know what I mean? Like, but guys, don't wish harm on no one, all right? Pray for your enemy. Love your enemy, all right? And it might change. I'm sorry. I should be looking at the camera. And I keep looking at my big ass nose. <laughs> All right, look. I salute, man. Every one more time. One more time. Okay. Pittsburgh versus everybody. But guess what? This is the Yinder Squad. So you are Pittsburgh. If I'm Pittsburgh and I with you and you with me, that means we Pittsburgh. We together. This is the team. This is the home team. Get true. Or die line, baby. It's truth or die with Iggy. One love, baby. I'll see you in live in a little bit.